So, um, Warner Brothers has made a lot of movies. A lot of them are really well known that set the world on fire. But then there are also some that just no one bothered to show up to or don't even know Warner Brothers made or released or produced. And one of the ones that they did release that is really obscure is the 2001 Kate Blanchett war drama, Charlotte Grey. Um, got mixed reviews when it came out and it only made about five million at the box office. Um, but I don't think that affects its quality. I think Kate Blanchett's a really solid um, war drama. Um, Kate Blanchett's performance is really great in this. I mean, it's Kate Blanchett. I mean, has she ever had a bad performance before? Um, Michael Gambon was also really good, as well as the other actors, Billy Crubbed, Crubbed Up, and Rupert Pe Perry Jones. I think there's one actor that I didn't think do didn't do that well, or I just, it's that one guy, that, that one character, who, or that one guy who plays the character that forces Charlotte to be his friend. And yeah, that's my one, that's currently my main issue with the film. I think that little subplot, it kind of went nowhere, and I just don't think it was really needed in here. I feel like if you took that out, then movie would be like better but as it is um this film is for the most part it works well the way it is cinematography is very gorgeous um just love the variety of wide shots the sunset silhouettes and some of the shots of the trains like there was one shot that just looked so gorgeous it looked like a painting it was like the train was like right around here and then it's steam or smoke was puffing out and it just looked so much bigger it looked like art a lot of shots are like a lot of shots in the movie are like that yeah um i do think charlie gray is a really good film and um i suggest checking it out if you are wanting are looking for more film, war drama films or just more films with Kate Blanchett. Um, this one is worth checking out. Wonder if they'll get a Blu-ray someday.